Hey guys, how y'all doing? I'm here to give you guys a short recap on the new episode of Gyakuten Saiban Sono Shinjitsuku Igi Ari, or you could call it just Ace Attorney, which is on episode 2. Now, just by looking at this episode, it looks like nothing much was really going on, just a little like, um, blame on a murder case here and there, and I guess like, um, someone is being the innocent victim being punished, yada yada yada, so if anything else, let's go. Okay, at the beginning of the beginning of the episode, we have to it that um, Naruhodo, whatever, however you pronounce his name, um, is pretty much getting ready to like um, possibly go to a dinner of Chihiro along with like um, another person being called, and that's her, that's Chihiro's little sister. And apparently, after seeing what's been going on, there's a guy who's been like um, overhearing this over the over the phone. Apparently, so I just go like, oh, looks like there's some bad. Vibes around here, and it made it too obvious that he he was gonna murder her or something after hearing her over the phone. And apparently, Naruhodo comes up, comes to the comes to Chihiro's office, and apparently she was killed, and her sister was there. And per, and it seems like she's arrested for thinking that she's the murderer. You know, well, she's well, people or the police or the detective thinks that she is the murderer. Apparently. But we have to it that um, Naruhodo has someone that can help her out. But apparently he that person gets a call from that same guy possibly who's been overhearing Chihiro Spawn. He on the other hand gets um, drafted possibly blackmailed to not want to defend her, you know. And Naruhodo remembers something about like a couple things here and there and tries to go find some more evidence apparently. Which is really ridiculous. Not to mention some pathetic comedic effects that shouldn't be all like um too funny and so forth so when it came to like um, him being the defense attorney he's up against someone called like a Mitsurugi, Mitsurugi Reiji from what I heard in this episode and so forth they say that this guy's like um really really like um a person that never lost a case or something so that's another thing to be concerned about because Reiji's up against him apparently and of course, like, um, Naruhodo is up against him alone. He used to have Chihiro by his side, but now no longer. And apparently, like, um, Naruhodo tell, tells, um, Chihiro's little sister, Mayoi, to, like, don't worry, I'm gonna give all my god to, give all I have to help you out, you know? And nothing much going on here and there, but, um, yeah, it kind of, like, um, went into, like, a, a cycle. And it ends off where, um, he's ready to, like, um, Face face um Reiji head on by himself without Chihiro. So yeah. Anyways, um when I looked at this episode, I guess like maybe the comedic effects with comedy scenes were really annoying, not to mention about like what's been going on here and there and so forth. And from what I heard like um from many other people, especially um some other friends of mine, they did not really enjoy like um how it's being adapted properly, possibly. So I do not know what is really going on, but one thing for sure, things are starting to get a little like um, hectic. I just don't like the comedic comedy scenes, possibly, because that kind of like bothered me a bit. I just go like, can't you take this a little bit seriously? But I was told it was a little cheesy here and there. I don't know, but until then, I guess the episode came out okay. But I guess the comedy was just not. Just a good thing. So until then, I'll see you guys in my next video. So I'm Alpha Zero. Have a good day, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace out. Bye-bye.